is uh, my new picture is fine or fail. Hopefully you feel this. This is a fine. So I've been obsessed with this whole Indian inlay with cabinets and drawers and I just figured I would do it myself. So this right here is my raw piece of furniture that needs a little bit of happiness. I'm sanding down the first layer. I did not like the stain. So that's what I'm doing right here. Um, with my cabinet fronts, it had hardware actually nailed to the front of my cabinet. So yeah, I'm removing it with a nail and screwdriver. And then this is what it looks like when it's sand versus the ones that are not sand to the right. And then I came back in and stained it with a new stain. I think it looks great because it brings out all those knots and imperfections of the wood. You know, that industrial design is really important now. But anyways, all of the information, the products they use will all be in the description box down below. Here goes the cabinet fronts. I stained each of the cabinet drawers. This is just a close up so that you can see it. I use an old t-shirt. So nothing expensive there. And then here goes the product. I think it looks beautiful without the Indian inlay, but we're still going to do the Indian inlay. And of course, by we, I mean me, I'm going to do all that. Each of these stencils were like uh, anywhere from like $6.99 to $1.99 from uh, Michaels or Joanne Fabric. So, and if it's a foam brush and plain or white paint from Joanne Fabrics, foam brushes are like 99 cents. So very cheap. No rhyme or reason, just pick a, a design, put the design where it actually fits in on your piece of furniture and then stencil it. Pretty easy. So I'm gonna use the stencils to see which one design I want on the outside here. I think I'm gonna go with these stars on the outside. Let's see, the stars fit right here too. Yeah, they do. Okay, those were not stars those are diamonds obviously but that internal conversation out loud that I was having with myself yeah I just you know when you talk to yourself you can say whatever you want to but again blotting it on pulling it off and voila repeat the design over and over again until you figure out what you want I also came in with some of the more intricate designs with thin um, brush <music> I'm gonna go with the little elephants at the bottom and I do have like an elephant thing going on in here I just the pictures are not in here I don't know where the hell that elephant picture went but anyways um, I do like elephants and I'm getting distracted by text messages uh, all right. <laughs> 